player to watch this season uh, definitely would probably be Vitor Saba and Romeo from our team. Player to watch this season, Brendan Helmel. And for the league? Across for the league, across the league, uh, it would be a tough one. A lot of good players. Um, I'd probably say A1 and Bill from uh, Adelaide United. Player to watch. Um, well, being the first year in the A-League, I've heard a lot about Berisha. So he's deadly in the box and stuff like that. Matt Spiranovic. I think um, Matty's uh, had surgery in the off-season and started looking very good last season and will be pushing for a Socceroos spot this year. I think David Villa, obviously. He's coming as a, as a big name and I think he's going to be an important player for, for Melbourne City and I'm looking forward to compete with a player of his quality. Obviously David Villa for the next 10 games will be very interesting to see. Uh, also, you know, to see if Borussia can uh, um, produce the same goods that he did in Brisbane at Melbourne Victory. But, um, you know, I'm, I'm interested more so rather than other teams uh, looking at our own squad and see what uh, our new players produce. Uh, someone like Romeo coming in with a lot of experience, I'm really excited to see what he can he can do. Unfortunately, we didn't have him in the ACL um, and I'm, I'm looking at him to go and, and someone like a Brendan Hamill who's done a fantastic job for us. A young kid who's got a very good head on his shoulders and <clears throat> hopefully he's going to be very successful and he's making it difficult for our centre-back pairing. I think someone like a Berisha, uh, you know, he's at Melbourne Victory now. Um, obviously he's had a, a great couple of years at Brisbane but um, he's going to look to you know, prove a point I think at Vidri and big club, maybe, maybe someone like him.